All right, ladies and gentlemen, a time for the final match of the afternoon here for King of the North. And what a match it should be. We have in the, the black singlet, Blake Underwood, the freshman or incoming sophomore from Marathon last year in his freshman campaign, finishing a third, a tough 106 pound weight class. And he's taking on a Jake Fitzpatrick of Aquinas who picked up the first two points pretty quickly here. Fitzpatrick about to be a senior, three time state place winner, does have a state title to his name. Won it as a sophomore and good follow there by uh, the Blue Gold Senior. Underwood trying to scoot his hips through. And with these Aquinas guys, we've seen it all afternoon, are just so dangerous on top. As Fitzpatrick had those legs split. Now just slowly climbing up, trying to pick up some near fall with 105 left here in the first. Underwood still looking to work his way up here with a nice shoulder roll and just another good follow by Fitzpatrick. Did you want to do a gear announcement like between periods? On the reset, 35 seconds remaining in the opening period. Patrick with a leg in right now, has it sunk in deep too. Trying to find that opposite arm of Underwoods. And with that leg sunk in, just makes it tough for Underwood to make any progress because that's his uh, first priority basically. And it's Patrick with an arm bar in. Trying to find a turn with short time here in the first period. Okay. And Fitzpatrick will ride out Underwood. And he'll head to the second with a 2-0 lead. Fitzpatrick opting to go a neutral in this situation. Did get that quick first takedown. And Fitzpatrick just with that lightning quick speed, able to get behind. Did pick up a takedown, but now Underwood looking to secure a potentially a reversal here. Does have that ankle lifted up. Fitzpatrick just showing off that hip strength right now and Nice work by Underwood. Has a leg in. No points yet, though, given up by Fitzpatrick. What a sequence here between these two. And wow, what a sequence there with uh, no points scored from that besides the initial takedown. Now Fitzpatrick has built up to a 4-0 lead. What is the final match of the afternoon here at AT Elite Performance Center? Now that Fitzpatrick settled in on top. This makes it tough for Underwood when they're starting from square one. And a reset in the middle with 33 seconds remaining. Oh, law coach Corey Scanlon has to be uh, pretty excited about how the law program performed tonight. And uh, still have a full period and some change left in this match. But right now, Fitzpatrick... Controlling most of this as he has another leg sunk in deep. And we'll head to the third period. At Jake Fitzpatrick with the 4-0 lead on Blake Underwood. And 
start of the third period. Underwood does it choose down and able to get in on a leg right away if Fitzpatrick. Just keeping control though, keeping his hips back. Or Fitzpatrick still in control in this situation. Wonder if Underwood at some point might try to just look to circle out and find one. Now that he finally has a little bit of space here. At Fitzpatrick just jumping sides. Still showing off that quickness in the third period. I think now we're just starting to see it. All this time on top starting to wear down on Underwood. So we'll get a reset in the middle. One minute, 10 seconds remaining. And Underwood was going for a shoulder roll there. Nice chop though by Fitzpatrick. Oh, Underwood, or Fitzpatrick with a bar and looking to get the stack victory here. Close the afternoon out with the pin and does exactly that. The pin in five minutes and nine seconds. And that will do it, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for tuning in live this afternoon. We apologize for the time.